And I, my publishing company really truly focuses primarily on sharing women's stories, which if you knew me even 15 years ago would be a shock. And I think for like what Diane shared and, and you as well, Lisa, there's, there was a river I'd heard. I saw the movie The Way because in the United States, it really wasn't talked about. The Camino wasn't really known. The Appalachian Trail, yes. The Pacific mm-hmm. Coast Trail, yes. Mm-hmm. But although I'd grown up camping, I really didn't have any desire to, to, to rough it that much. And, and I was looking for something different. It was a physical challenge, but it was even more so an emotional one. And so when I heard about the Camino, it was like one of those things that, like you were talking about, Diane, like the books falling off the shelf, it just kept showing up in different ways. And I didn't know when, but I knew I would. And then as I shared bef- as we before we started recording the live session, I was in a business meeting and a woman who I'd never met before. She lives in London. She grew up in Ireland. I'm from the United States. She sat down next to me and she said, what what do you do? What do you do? I take women walking on the Camino. And literally the first words out of my mouth were, you're shitting me. (laughs) No way. (laughs) How is that even possible? And uh, I, on the break, I went up and called my sons and said, this is something I really want to do. Uh, it's in this time period. How do you feel about that? And they were like, go. Uh, and I signed up that day um, for, you know, nine months later to to walk. And, and I did do walking, Diane. I walked every day, variety of different things, different packs and sticks. We talk, we'll talk about the importance of sticks when we get to that point. 